very, very uh, inspiring. <laughs> Today I would like to share with you a really cool DIY mini bike project. This initially was a gasser that was converted to electric and this mini bike can be set up as a chill cool ride or a revving monster powerhouse. It does not require to weld or do super heavy modifications. It can be able to be done with basic tools that pretty much anyone who owns in their household. The coolest part that I like and the biggest advantage here is that you can upgrade this frame any way and any time you want. More speed, more power or more range can be added and it's not hard. You can start with the basic setup and upgrade as you go with off the shelf parts. Frame can be reinforced if you want crazy speeds and it's very stable and super comfortable. Let's start with the frame and go over the components list first, specs and what else can be done as a next step. This type frame can be bought online, brand new, or you can find it on Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace for really, really cheap. You can buy one of those used mopeds and then remove the gasoline engine and start from there. The easiest, fastest way is by placing a hub motor like in this DIY project, or you can also weld a motor plate and add a brushless motor and set up a chain drive. In the front, we have a Kabu Wolf scooter fork, motorcycle handlebars with Audi grips, the standard 200cc frame, which we talked about already, the rear coil suspension set to soft, extended rear arm. The hubs can be placed inside of the frame also where they originally were installed. We have a front and back 13 inch tire with 4000 watts, 72 volts motors. The battery is 72 volts, 50 amp capacity. Top speed is 60 miles an hour, range easily over 70 miles. The motors output 4000 watts peak 10 kilowatts. All parts were nicely encased in plastic. There's plenty of room left to add more batteries if needed. This mini bike is so much fun riding in the city and I think off-roading will do even better, but hopefully that's coming in the next video. I added description box links with similar parts, but top speed of 50 miles an hour so you can start with a more moderate power output and grow from there. I have to warn you, this ride is fast, awesome looking and extremely comfortable easy to control and super fun to ride. This can be super handy for under 70 miles commutes. If you like to ride longer distances, there's plenty of space to add more cells and increase past 100 miles in range. Total cost is around $2,000. If you like this video and you like to see similar DIY projects, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button, share this video and I'll see you next time. <laughs> and you sit down and it's so comfortable. But why the small scooter tire? I think if you get a tire, it feels like you're so low. So <laughs>